my role entails leading and managing strategic partnerships as we are driving our market entry growth into Kenya and East Africa. I am passionate about education. I have been in the education space for close to 14 years now. I'm now working with a wonderful organization, Nexpo, that is really keen on democratizing education because we believe that everybody should have access to high quality, affordable education. So without further ado, I'll invite the rest of my team. My name is Betty. I'm part of the application specialist team. I'm Roberta. I'm part of the Nexpo team. I joined as an admin associate. So my name is Alex, Alex Wanjao. I'm the performance marketing um, executive at Nexpo. My name is Nancy. Similarly to Alex, we work together as a performance marketing executive. Um, all our programs are future focused and competency based. So what does competency based mean? But basically what it means is we are keen on ensuring that all the learners who go through our programs demonstrate mastery of skill or competence for whatever it is that they are learning. We currently have some learners, we have applicants. So it would be good for us to interact. My name is Busara Mohammed. I'm a hustler. I've come to see if I can be a learner. Held graduation ceremonies. In total, it has come to over 5,000 graduates globally. We are really privileged to be joined uh, by three learners. Yes, my name is Sir Catherine Mea Korompoi, a teacher by profession. I'm taking an MBA in Expo University, the place to be. There was a time my daughter was going through online. Then she mm -hmm. happened to see. Then later, she told me, I think it's better if you can take this course because mm -hmm. it will help you be able to manage the school. Yeah. My name is Bernard Mulwa. I've been in the bank industry for that five years. I'm moving more to managing a circle and a lot of skills are acquired, management skills, marketing strategy and all that. When I went through the courses, you know, for the BBA I'm doing, I realized it can help me to enhance my skills in that area. One of the reasons why I picked Nexford and it speaks to what I'm doing is I wanted to make sure I'm doing something that is future fit. So future ready. And, and actually, as you were saying earlier with artificial intelligence and things like that, future is now. One thing that was very important for me was it must be purely online and it must be future focused and it must be affordable. And when I was searching, and by then I was just looking for an MBA, and then I saw this MBA with AI, and I was saying this is really future focused. In fact, I I couldn't choose for a while because there was AI, there was cybersecurity, there's entrepreneurship, there's sustainability. Those are really future-ready courses. And that's how I ended up picking this particular course. To Raymond, now you talked about a course that is affordable. For a hustler, affordability is very relative. Maybe for me, it can be a bit of a struggle. How do you advise some of us to go around it? Especially if we are going through issues or to do with finances and yet still to do those courses. Finances are tough. Even for $200, when the dollar was what it was two months ago, three months ago, and you're paying school fees for other people, you're doing whatever, it, it was a strain. But the thing, and remember what Nextford can do, is you can stack your credentials. So you can do certifications in pieces that will help you gain credits so that by the time you have probably saved enough to do the main course, you've already cut it probably in half of three quarters. So that's what I would suggest for anybody who's doing that, the stackable courses. Nextford does its communication. Is it entirely through email or um, is it maybe through a Slack channel? Because someone like me, all my five emails are almost full and I missed an important communication the other day. So if there are alternative methods, maybe if you enroll in a certain course, they put you in a Slack channel for that course for the sake of communication it could be a good thing. Maybe you can tell us how communications are done. About communication, I can assure you that Nextcode is number one in communication. First of all, the time I enrolled, the first thing you should know is that they will not give you breaks. They will call you. <laughs> calling you, literally calling you. They'll give you calls every time to ensure that you don't have any problem, to ensure that you are, you are enrolling and the starting is smooth registration they took me through registration they took me through everything that i wanted to know that particular time and this other time they communicate through email they communicate through chats through whatsapp uh there was a lady by the name betty i guess that the one and she could not give me sleep and she gave me sleepless night she made sure i enrolled and i was comfortable and then the others would chip in there is the advising team, there is the, the success team. So every time 
you are on toes because they will not let you rest. At least they want to know if you have a problem, they chip in. You ask them what to do, they help you, they assist you. When it is time for assignments, you are reminded. So every time there is an, ass an assessment, um, an assignment coming, you have to know. Anytime um, there is a live session, you are told three days before that particular time. Like today, we had a, a live session that was in the afternoon. So you are, you are on toes throughout. We really hope that was helpful towards making your decision in joining Nextport for one of our programs. And um, all the very best. Thank you.